So it reminded me of one I used to know. <laughs> if I remember this as we go along. Also about camels. See, the camel did not always look the way he does today. Once he, his back looked more like that of a horse, with a smooth back, with nothing in the middle of it. Now oh God, we said that God put the camel on earth to help man, and so correct to point out, that the camel's temperament sometimes got in the way. There was a farmer in the desert. He was very unsuccessful, because he lived in the desert. <laughs> but you got to give him credit for trying. <laughs> and he had a camel. And he tried to get the camel to plow the fields. Well, the camel had a very definite opinion of this. <laughs> when the farmer asked the camel, tried to put the camel into a plow, the camel looked at the farmer and he said, Humph! And this irked the farmer greatly, because every time he tried to plow his field, the camel would just look at him and say, Humph! So the farmer prayed to God for a solution. Please, God, I'm a farmer in the desert. I need all the help I can get. <laughs> what can you do with this camel? Every time I try and do any work with him, all I get is a hump. God sent a messenger to the camel. Said, camel, do not say hump to the farmer when he tries to get you to plow his land. The camel didn't listen. He kept on saying hump, hump, hump. Finally, there was but one solution. Camel, he, God said, you have given the farmer so many humps that now I'm going to give you one. <laughs> and so that is how the camel got a hump on his back. <laughs>